There's a checkpoint. It's kind of a different, like, design of a checkpoint, but it's still a checkpoint. And the annoying snails are still in this version. So that's just annoying. But as you can see, Tails is actually in this version, and he's sort of functional. He's not really all that functional, and he... I think he loses your rings as well if a bad guy hits Tails, so... He's more of a hindrance than anything, but... Like, I'm pretty sure the level design's already been decided in this version. Because as you can see, it's pretty much like the same thing, aside from the fact that they're snails. Except that isn't supposed to do that. So that hasn't been programmed in correctly yet. Aside from that, it's basically just the same thing as normal Emerald Hill Zone. So, might as well just reset. Stage 2 is going to be the same thing. Let's go to Wood Zone. That's that's new. And as you can see, it plays a very beta-ish version of the Metropolis theme. And this is a completely different zone right here. It's it's very interesting. So, yeah, this is, this is one of those, like, beta little zones that they kind of never added. Right here, there's really nothing you can do. Unless you have debug mode, and then you can just come up here, but there's really nothing up here. Down there is just death, so let's go up. And there's some more stuff up here. You got these, like, conveyor belts that don't work at all. And over here you got these little things, you can just run across them. Tails is flying all over the place, because he's confused. And there's a little area up here at the start, for some reason, I'm not sure what that was for. But that's, that's pretty much it for Wood Zone, because there's, there's not much of this level programmed into the game yet, so it, it's pretty empty. It's not that impressive, to be honest. So let's just... <laughs> that was an interesting little sound effect right there that played. Uh, let's go to the Metropolis Zone. As you can see, they already have three levels programmed in for Metropolis Zone, so they were being jerks from the very beginning. And this plays the same Metropolis theme. And that almost killed me. But as you can see, these little things don't push you up nearly as high as they're supposed to, so you're going to need debug mode if you want to go any further than a few things. Those things don't squish you properly. Nothing works properly in these old betas, but I mean, that's that's pretty much what do you, I mean, what do you expect? They're called a beta for a reason. It does not appear that there are any rings in this level yet. So, we're probably going to need to spawn some in just so I don't die. But as you can see, there are a few slight differences. The can little whatever those things are don't work yet. The screws are here. I'm pretty sure, yeah, they work. Down here. Uh, that's not where I'm supposed to go. I don't really think there's much else in the first level that's different. I think it's like the th second or third level that's mainly different. Yeah, that's the end of that level. Because there's something in, I think, Act 2 or 3 that I need to show. I think it's Act 3. But as you can see, that was originally um, lava, and it's not anymore. But I don't have debug mode on, so this is going to be fun. I'm not even sure if I can get through this level without... Yeah, okay, this is one of those things I wanted to show. It's an interesting little, like, sideways lift thing. I'm not... I mean, it's it's kind of awkward. It's, it's, it's cool, but it's weird. So, there's that. I'm, I'm surprised those things actually work. That's like a mess of an area. Alright, reset. And I didn't want to do that. Oh hey, Aquatic Ruin Zone. Alright, Hilltop Zone, that's pretty obvious what that's going to be. And it's Hilltop Zone's music, but slowed down and with a different instrument. But as you can see, this version's basically the same thing, except I'm sure the lava actually works now, yeah. 
So, and they replace those green block, like, blob things. So, yeah, the little tubes don't work yet. So that's that. Um, Hidden Palace Zone's here, and it's still the same thing as it was in Alpha. Except it's using, like, um, Mystic Caves sounds. Like, or song, not sounds. I'm pretty sure that the level is literally exactly the same as, um... The alpha, like even the freaking tails monitor is still there. So I don't think they've done anything to this level since the alpha version. But I do not know that for sure, so we will check to be 100% positive. I'm not even going to try to pro that. No, nope. I want you to spin dash Sonic. And that still doesn't work. There's still nothing down there, as you can see. Over here, he got the little whatchamacallit thing again. Which works the same way. Comes up from there. He got the little whatchamacallit, and then the level ends. So it's literally the exact same, except for the music. Alright. Oil Ocean Zone is slightly different. As you can see, there's these little things, which you can stand on. But I mean, I'm pretty sure that's about it, in terms of what there is. And it uses a slowed-down version of the two-player Casino Night theme. And I'm just running on air, not caring. Sonic doesn't even give a fuck. He's just running through the sky. But this is one of the more finished levels, actually. So yeah, that's basically this. There's not much else to show there. Dust Hill Zone, what is this? And Dust Hill is just Mystic Cave. Alright, let's see what we have here. A death trap. Awesome. As you can see, it's kind of similar to the main, like the final version, but not really. And it's impossible to get around this place without debug. Because there's no springs or anything yet. Alright, that's pretty much it for that. Casino Night, let's see what we have here. Well, this place looks like a hot and eyesore. And it's kind of glitchy. Alright, now the debug mode is on, let's try this again. So yeah. kind of a mess in here. And a lot of the stuff isn't, like, a lot of the floors aren't programmed in right yet, so it's kind of like you're gonna fall through the floor. But yeah, whatever. And those things aren't there yet, because that wouldn't make any sense. So, yeah, Casino Night is kind of a glitchy mess. Well, I mean, it's not really glitchy, but it just looks really weird. Alright. Chemical plant zone, let's go here. <coughs> well, the song sounds about right. Let's see if the um, stuff is actually correctly programmed now. And 
I can't do anything. All the pipes are programmed correctly. Well, that's good to know, I guess. And the goo makes a different sound effect. Alright. <clears throat> My voice is kind of going away, so I'm probably going to end this up. Oh boy! Genocide City? That doesn't sound kid-friendly at all. Uh, let's go check it out. And it's Chemical Plant again. And the level is completely empty. Yes. This level is completely empty, guys. There's nothing here. And all you can do is, like, make boxes. Which don't do anything. So, that's, that's that. Genocide City is empty. I'm kind of glad, because I don't even want to know what that place would have looked like. Uh, Neo Green Hill Zone. And that is Aquatic Ruin. So, yeah, that's, that's what that is. Um, I don't really... Th well, there is actually, like, the bottom half of the level, I don't think, is programmed in. Yeah, it isn't. As you can see, if you fall right there, you de you're dead. But as you can see, this level's actually, like, semi-finished, because the, like, signpost is actually there. It's even worse in Act 2, because, as you can see, if you fall into this water, you're dead. So if you miss this jump, you're dead. It, it's... I don't know. I'm not sure if I like that or not. I mean, it is a lot harder, but, I don't know. Whatever. I'm not sure. I don't think the bosses... Yeah, it's not. I don't think any of the bosses, aside from Emerald Hill, are programmed in. And that apparently sends me back to Chemical Plant. I know that there's, like... If you press, like, just start on the main menu, it sends you to, like, Aquatic Ruin, and it basically sends you through the levels that are finished, which I'm pretty sure are Aquatic Ruin, Chemical Plant, Emerald Hill, and Hilltop. But I'm not sure. Um, Death Egg Zone... is empty and very quiet. Too quiet. It's kind of awkward. Alright. Let's go back to the menu then. Alright. Uh, special stage, does that do anything? It doesn't let me select it at all. Okay. Uh, sound set. Sound test. And it just plays all the music. As you can see, a lot of the music isn't... Like, it's kind of different. It's... And that's... Casino Night. Mystic Cave. Um... Mystic Cave 2 player. Quantic Ruin. Death Egg sounds very trollish. And very annoying. Special stage. Uh, level select. Another level select. The final boss, even though that's not programmed in at all. Chemical plant. The boss theme. Sky chase, even though that's not anywhere in this game. Um, oil Ocean. More Oil Ocean. Bleh, oil Ocean. Wing Fortress. Even though that's not in the game either. Emerald Hill 2-player. The, I think, 2-player theme. Super Sonic's theme. Hilltop. More Hilltop. Extra Life. That's all that, whatever. So yeah, um, I'm pretty sure that's about it, actually. So, that's basically the betas in a 
nutshell. I mean, it's there's all kinds of like little things that you could point out that are different than the final version, but that's basically just like the gist of it. So, yeah, now that I've shown off all the beta stuff that I plan on showing and all the stuff in the main game, I guess I will end it off here. So, thank you all for watching. I will see you guys in the next Let's Play.